original mm. Original bad man oh. I like you but Don't get me started I know you want me My baby Gently Me loving it She giving me Steadily Moving it, moving it jet jelly I like how you giving me steadily Wind up your body daily, no matter No pattern Give me any how you feel I'm a muggy You make my head to swell I make a man feel sweat Baby love me gently Baby kiss me gently I know you want me I know you want me Baby love me Commercial break, guys. We hit a thousand on TikTok, and that means I can go live on TikTok. If you haven't followed me, follow me at Kim Tobea. For those who have followed me, thank you so so much. I can't wait. I'm figuring out TikTok, but I'm so excited to reach a milestone. Every milestone is oh my god, this TikTok game has reminded me where I started from back to normal videos. Baby love you, Jen. So guys, I'm doing my laundry and this is how actually I'm set up <laughs> for now. Yes. Emotion wise. So I think that should be. Cotton and large. But if you want to, it would be good to use images that I think that's the you best have to way to put it. Then yeah. I'm gonna do it. Yeah. Really so, 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 you need to zangle. You need 12. It's 12. 12 units. Just remove my first load. Yes. How much you need? It has used. Yes. Just keep in mind my fridge is on. Yeah. So that's how much it has used. Two hours later. Guys, I've done full load that whole basket. Like that's three loads because I had to separate my whites from colors. Mama taught me that. <laughs> you remember where we started? I have from the first load now it's 11.68 so I'm gonna minus and put on the screen how many units go so guys I have just finished cleaning the bed <laughs> I've just finished doing laundry guys and guys my birthday I gifted myself earlier with the laundry machine and I'm so thankful about it because I've done like five canvas canvas are <laughs> Kwani can go dry line uh, laundering. Five, five of them. I'm so happy that I gifted myself that and I'm so happy at I, I take any units because I was able to edit uh, the video huh? and I've finished my other works. I've eaten while my my laundry was machine machine. Now I've already finished <sighs> taking them upstairs to the rooftop to hair dry and I'm so thankful of that inshallah God will gift me with a dry dryer but I'm thankful for what he has gifted me now now I'm gonna do my bed uh, because it's cleaning day and I love my sheets so clean how many times do you change your sheets comment down below and I'm looking for for a better I'm looking for a better thing. Yeah, so I'm trying out this type of color. Still have white. This new scheme of color. And I'm finding I want to find bigger pillowcases. Like big. Yeah. Yeah, big. And I want king size or 
pillowcases and decorative pillows also like bigger than this but you see this color Linda could rhyme so yeah I bought it to try out this I am color blind yeah so probably I'm just gonna do a time slap gently. baby kiss me gently I know you want me I know you want me baby love me gently I have made the bed but it is for the thumbnail the bed and I want bigger pillow like big I don't know where to get them but I'm gonna search for them so in case you want sheets <clears throat> in case you want sheets um, I know where to get them yeah white sheets or maybe this color just order in time yeah Mm, and my bed my bed dimension i thought it was four by six but i feel like it's a double like true double bed or maybe it will go five by six i don't know i'll write the measurements on the screen but i don't know if anyone wants to hear that so yeah soon i'm gonna be doing a detailed video of everything and where i got them exactly oh my god this flower, I don't know if you remember when I was unboxing it, Roses Forever New York. This flower have, they are real flowers, but I don't know how they preserve it. There's a video I did about them. These flowers can last up to a year. Now, these flowers were sent to me, I think at around March. Nebaka says it, they're smelling nice. They're still here, so I'm thankful. <laughs> I know you want me. I know you want me. Baby, love me gently. Baby, touch me gently. I know you want me. I know you want me. Want me. Oh, hey guys, I'm preparing cowboy caviar, and one of the ingredients is sweet corn. So I bought sweet corn from Carrefour Farm Fresh Market. And I'm boiling it on my instant pot. Already googled the recipe. <laughs> so I need the skillet. I don't know. The stand. Then I'm going to pour one or two cups of water. <clears throat> yeah, that's two. You can see there is measurements there. Now... So what they look like this, I'm going to remove the husk, there's no need for the husk. The leaves, I bought them on offer, you can buy it anywhere. This is sweet corn, not the white corn. It's good for salad. If you want me to show you the salad, let me know in the comment section below. And if you like this kind of videos, also let me know below. Comment of whatever I can be practicing cooking in my insert pot. So that's it. I'm gonna use sea salt because I believe it tastes better. I'm gonna like do half a half a teaspoon of salt. So my water is in there. I'm gonna put half a teaspoon of salt on the water. I already have the water here, and then I'm just gonna place the corn. I have two i'm living alone so that's why i only need two <sighs> wow it's hard living alone then i'm gonna close my lid you can see here so the reason why i'm calling it in start point is for the youtube algorithm but obviously i have a nutri cook is the same thing as an insert point it's an electric pressure cooker none of these companies are paying me i'm doing it because i want to put you on guys and it takes a little steamer i'll show you the 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 units that will take so after putting that i'm gonna make sure the lid is closed you can see it's locked when it's locked you, it will tell you so so don't ever put here because it will do nothing always put see this is venting always put it on ceiling when you're cooking as you can see the the units i have is 14.17 units it's a prepaid token 
we're gonna put the sweet corn on pressure cook and do four minutes you can do two minutes but i like my my corn really well cooked so i'm doing four minutes that's what i do and then i just start here at 10 it's gonna pressure build for 15 to 20 minutes no 10 to 15 minutes then it will start i'll show you as you can see the pressure is on and i walked away yeah there's no need to stay there for like this is the best investment i've ever done as you can see it's done the, the we have to cancel because i don't want it to keep warm to continue okay. i want to eat to pressure release and as you can see steamy metumika ngapi it is 13.84 and initially we started with how much initially initially before starting the insert point we started with 14.17 and now it's 13.84 when you minus calculate it only use 0 0.33 units not even one full unit so you be the judge if if this thing actually is good or not but for me i feel it's more less work and it, actually in my apartment you're not allowed to use jiko so it works perfectly for me you see when you pressure release, it's now nice. <laughs> naturally pressure release. It's okay. Now we see this is our perfect corn. Well, perfect. And you can see the water is down there. So let's see if it's cooked. Well, guys, you can tip me on my PayPal so I can buy tongs. <laughs> I'm still moving in, guys. Oh, fuck. I just wanted you to see that this thing is cooked to perfection. Today, guys, is chicken day. Wow. Potatoes and chicken that I marinated for 48 hours. Let's see how it's going to go. Baby, love me gently. Baby, hold me gently. I know. My Friday night is lit, guys. Mm, look, at, look at how juicy this is. Wow. Mm, 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 mm. I rarely go to town, but when I go, it's to pick up some stuff from the PO box. Then I made the feta sandwiches. Then I did a video call, WhatsApp video call. I'm always on WhatsApp video call with my sister and the Viela, Nana, and my other sister, Mama, El Mama Ella, <laughs> Amy. <laughs> so we do and catch up. I thought it was a voice. You could hear their voice, but I was screen recording, so you can't hear their voice. So anyway, back to cooking. This means my mama sent from the village. Our farm is harvesting maize currently and I'm going to be cooking it there. Baby, touch me gently. I know you want me. I know you mess but don't mind about that so these are beans yeah recording these are beans and i'll make a special dish called githeri i've already soaked my beans here but i want to tell you these are beans when it came from my sister my mom these are straight from our farm our central our central farm my mom has harvested 
uh, maize it's the main cash crop cash crop in Kisi in my village so she sent this from the village here to Nairobi and I picked it up from my sisters and thank you mama Miss Kiteri may I have it because this is fresh corn it's yakauka it will not take that long so I'm just soaking these beans they are called nyayo you can see it I think you can see yeah nyayo and then I'm gonna use my instant pot pressure cooker to to show you someone was asking me oh Kemto does it take a lot of electricity it does not and I'm gonna show you because now we have another new prepaid prepaid what prepaid this thing this bulky things from Kenya power I'm gonna show you the units before I start boiling and then I'll show you the units after I finish boiling the theory yes stay tuned for awesome vlogs so here is my instant pot I'm gonna drain the water I've soaked them for four hours so I've washed and rinsed the beans and and but uh, beans and maize corn so i'm gonna so you see it's four cup so i'm gonna double it to eight cups that's my concussion i'm gonna use i'm gonna boil it with my salt one teaspoon yeah the small the small spoon one teaspoon of sea salt so this is four cups of mixture of beans and and beans and maragwe and we need eight cups so this will be eight cups that's eight cup here is our this is our prepaid this is how kenya is come so five this is 4.35 units I'm not using anything else my fridge is on but I don't need to to put it down so that's how much it is we are going to put this on I'm going to put this on lock it when you lock it you put it in steaming and then pressure cook and then I'm going to do it for 40 minutes and that it's gonna build pressure up remember we are at 435 we're going to see if in a steamer mingi or no so that's what I do the pressure when the pressure builds up imagine it's okay so i'm gonna put this in the back see that video when i showed instructions but yeah this is called githeri it's well loved <laughs> yeah we're going to be back when it's done and let you know if it uses electricity or not someone requested me to tell them and yeah okay we'll be back after a while now that it's building pressure maybe so it's almost done one minute to go mm -hmm. it's done and i'm gonna cancel it will go directly to keep warm, but I don't want that it's already done. So I'm gonna wait for it to release the pressure naturally. And you can see here, it has gathered the water here. And this is how much electricity has used. So I will put a screen by screen. It used now it's three point five six and it was how much before we started you see so that's how much it has used 
So before it was 4.35, now it's 3.56. I've minus, that's like 75, 0 0.75, 0 0.75, like do the calculation, not even one full unit has gone and I boiled githeri. So I'm just waiting for it to release naturally, then I'll show you that the githeri is cooked under 45 minutes, like well cooked. So I waited for it to release pressure naturally, so even when I'm venting, there's no thingy coming up. Huh? I don't feel like... <laughs> I feel like it's... <laughs> this my indie was were tough but they're cooked <laughs> i like my marago to be cooked completely i feel like 40 minutes was not enough so i'm gonna do it again oh so let's leave up the way so it's cooked some are cooked Mm, they are cooked. They are cooked. So I'm putting in the green, yellow. Red capsicum and red onion. I'm trying in my potatoes. So for me, I like my kiteri to be really cooked because cooked that I like it mine to be a doctor. So that's why I'm a doctor for that. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of salt. It's not okay. A little bit of salt. I like to add my potatoes. I like my berry potatoes. So let's to the red green capsicum so that I can put when when it's already cooked. So I'm gonna use the spices, black pepper from all cream and garlic, little bit of that. And then I have this masala, we have to cut a little bit of the beef masala. And then I'm going to put a little powder. I got this to pack, but so much. But anyway, as I told you, I don't like cooking, cooking, and like sauteing the. I don't like it. I just like to saute on top of the stove. So I'm gonna pan fry this. With the spices. So I'm cooking so that I don't cook for the next two or three days. So 
Now the potatoes are cooked. I'm gonna put one cup of water and let the potato so, so the potatoes are cooked. I'm gonna put a, one cup of water and let it simmer so the viazi can cook. Then it will drop the beans. These are cooked. These are cooked guys. They are cooked. So I'm gonna put and my potato is well cooked now. I'm gonna pour it in. So I'm gonna mix up so that it can be mixed the potatoes. So I cook this much so that I don't have to cook every single day. Wow. So I'm gonna serve this and put the last one. <laughs> yes. So yeah, that's how I cook my githeri. Original. Original.